Oh, hello. I was just enjoying a snack here. <laughs> mm. Does it give it a does it give it away what my look is? Does it give away what my look is? Mm. Um, actually, I'm not an orange, <laughs> but I am Orange Blossom from Strawberry Shortcake, if you aren't aware. I will put a photo somewhere. And um, I just would like to point out that this is what she looks like. Not this. That's not what she looked like. This is what she looked like. Not this. This. Not this. Are we seeing the difference here? Can you guess which one came first? Hollywood, they always... <laughs> they think they slick. They think they slick. They're not. But that aside, because that is a conversation, a long conversation that we can have, but we won't, not today, at least. Hollywood, get your ish together, okay? No, this is about a Halloween look. I know it's spooky season, but we're taking a little turn, this, this uh, uh, video, <laughs> towards the more friendly realm of Halloween where you can be anything or anyone. And in this particular case, I am being a beloved cartoon character. Is she beloved? I'm not sure. I love her. <laughs> uh, yeah, but um, video, keep watching, we're here. I'll be here all week. <laughs> so we are up close and ready to start this look. I already did my brows as I often do in every video, but today I also primed already. So I primed with my usual, um, the Urban Decay Primer Potion, and then I used my P. Louise base in the shade Remore 1, which is white. So that is all I did. But we are going to get straight into this look, and boop, 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 we are featuring... Ooh, this today orange you glad i didn't say i was still gonna use patricia because <laughs> i know you guys are tired of those palettes but we have a new one today for this orange look so it's all themed and it all works and it all matches um and it's so pretty it's from ColourPop. Ooh. so this is the mirror but i haven't taken off the film yet but aren't these freaking gorgeous Oh my gosh. I did use um, Clementine last week. That's what I put on my lid as the glitter. Um, and I did also use Tangerine Dream last week, um, just in my inner corner. But today we're gonna do an entire look just with this palette. <laughs> you guys don't kill me, um, but I am actually gonna start with the Patricia palette. Um, we're gonna dive into this really pretty yellow that's called vitamin C. Cause that's what we need. We need some vitamin C. I'm gonna get into a slightly fluffier brush. And dip into that. And I'm gonna actually start in the inner quanto today. Honestly though, not to get preachy, but why do they keep trying us? Why do they keep trying us with these characters? Like they redo them and they're like lighter skin and they have straight hair and you're kind of like, we're not gonna notice. Like they really, they always be doing that and they really always be trying us. And honestly, it's some, it really upsets me. It upsets my soul. It is so... Hollywood really thinking they slick. They really do. So you can see that really nice yellow in the center there. Hmm. 
So now we're gonna go return to this really pretty palette and we're gonna go into mm, Sunkissed. And I'm just gonna tap that. And I'm gonna blend it into the edges. Okay, so I'm gonna need to swirl it a little bit more. I can't just tap it like my other palettes, but that's fine. At least the color payoff is pretty, ooh, yeah, it's nice. And I'm just gonna try to blend these two together because right now they're looking like two completely different colors, which they are, but I want them to blend. So I added a little bit of Zested, which is this really bright color over here, just to help it blend a little bit better because I'm gonna be honest, I'm having a tough time getting these two colors to blend <clears throat> the way I want them to. And now I'm going to go into this really darker, much darker orange, which is called Mimosa Mami. Mimosa Mami, I like these names. They're so, they sound sweet and like, wow. So that's nearly like highlighter. So I'm gonna also include this Ya Peel Me. <laughs> it's like Ya Feel Me, which is this deeper orange down here. And I'm gonna put that right. Do the same to the other eye. Okie dokie, so I, I, Realized last up video that I say okie dokie way too much. Anyways, so I have the foundation laid, but now we're gonna actually pick up something else that I bought that's really new, which is another Suvia Beauty palette. And this one is the Hydra, Hydra FX palette and it just came out. It's so gorgeous. Oh, the brush. <laughs> Look at these colors. I'm definitely gonna be utilizing this for another for another look, which is actually why I bought it, but I noticed that there's a really nice yellow in here that I would just love to utilize. So that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, why not? I guess we'll, we'll use the brush that it comes with, which is also really nice that it comes with the brush because not many palettes do, and especially like they have like really sharp brushes that are just perfect for like doing intricate little things and I'm gonna be doing something intricate, so it's gonna be fun. So we're gonna take this brush and dip it in some water because these are water activated products, um, which is why they're so amazing because they're, they really stay on I also think these glow in the dark, so I hope this isn't doesn't come out too highlighter, but I think it might. These might be a little bit more easy to like use than the actual individual little ones because I don't know. That was like really easy and usually I have to like swirl it a few times with the other stuff. So I'm gonna go in to my tear duct. But let's just do that to the other eye. Oh, we are doing stuff. I love it. <clears throat> Another thin brush, and I'm gonna dip into and I'm gonna I don't know if this is gonna work for me, but I'm gonna get dip into zested and kind of just see if I can pat that over it and I wonder if it'll like tone it down just a little bit because it's very highlight. <laughs> oh, that toned it down just the right amount. Here's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna actually line, but I'm gonna line with, so this is the P. Louise base and the Ott orange, which is what I used in the last my last video. Go check out my last video, it's very spooky. Um, but I noticed when I used it last time that it's very, very orange. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix these two, 
um, with the white and hopefully get something that is closer to the oranges that I am working with today. So let's give it a try. Okay, so I have something. I think it should work. Let's hope it works and let's line my eye. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Wow. I, okay, like I said, I was not expecting it to turn out like this, but I'm not mad at it. So what I'm going to do now is I just feel like this look needs some glitter because I mean, there's so many really nice glitters in this palette. There's three. Um, and so I need to utilize one. So I think I want to utilize Tangerine Dream. Um, so hopefully, <laughs> That will work out really nicely. So I think I'll put it in the center. Um, let's see what, what we can do, what will, what will happen to my look. So I got a really nice amount on there. Oh well. I'm gonna have to probably blend that out, but that's pretty. These are very soft. I will say that I think that you need to be really careful with the shimmers because they seem to, they just like spread. Like they just spread because they're just very, soft and so they just, kind of go everywhere like it definitely went outside of the reins of where I wanted it to go unintentionally but it's not necessarily a bad thing it's a very very cute colors hey okay so I did get it like all over the place but it's fine um I think that we're done with the eyes mm. I know, you're probably like, Jada, I'm surprised you're not gonna do more. It's like, I know. <laughs> There's like a little like devil and a little angel on my shoulder at all time that is just like, you can throw some other colors in there. You could, you can draw something on your face. It's like the devil side and the angel side's like, no, it looks pretty the way that it is. If you do any more, you're gonna ruin it. And that's just me battling 24 seven every time I do a makeup look like, is there more to do here? But there's not yet, we'll see. Right now I'm liking how this looks. So we're gonna go and throw on my foundation and lashes. And if I come back with more stuff on my face, I apologize. No, no, this is gonna be fine. I'll come back so we can do the lipstick, we can do the blush and the highlighter. Y'all already know the deal. I'll see you in a little bit. Oh, actually, hello again. I'm gonna start with my base. I usually don't show you this part and I'm not going to show you this part, but I have a new product. So, I know, I went shopping, y'all. So I always wanted to try milk. So I went out and I, I got some. Oh, you thought, oh, you thought I meant Milk, the cosmetic brand? I did. Is that joke bad? Is that a bad joke? I just love how this product looks. It's so pretty. And it just so happens to be named after one of my favorite beverages. <laughs> um, so it's so nice. I wasn't sure if I wanted to get the illuminating one and a part of me kind of feels like I should have just gotten the regular one But I do like a dewy look so We'll see Oh so cool <laughs> So like what am I Do I use my fingers? 
I still just look very casket ready. Oh, I guess oh, I can see the shine, the dewiness look. Hmm. Dewy. Okay. You may pros proceed to the fast forwarded part of my video. And uh, no, I didn't just bring milk out for that one joke. <laughs> Okie I am back. Hi. We got my lashes on, I got my foundation on, I got my concealer on, everything. We're almost done. And guys, you should be proud of me because I actually didn't add anything to this look, even though it is kind of killing me inside. So, um, let's start with blush. So, I'm going to use this palette, of course, like I did with everything else. Oh, I'm thinking of using Mimosa Mommy just because I am supposed to be like a cartoony character and they always, no matter they, they ethnicity or they shade or nothing, they always be putting them in some like ratchet blushes. So we gonna do that today. Uh, and I'm gonna direct this like only on the very apples of my cheeks. Kind of character. And this is where cartoon characters put blush for some reason. <laughs> and uh, you know me, I'm gonna also put a little bit on my nose. Yay! So. I'm gonna do lipstick next and then I go into highlighter after. So for my lipstick, guys, like I said, I went shopping, so I have some new colors. I uh I am going to line my lips with Fenty. And this is in the shade Um Freckled Fiesta. Yeah, Freckled Fiesta. So it's like a burnt orange. It's almost like you peel me, you peel me from the palette. So we're gonna just line my lips with this and I'll put some a little lighter of an orange color in the center. Oh, these go on so nicely. That's actually lighter than I expected it to be. <laughs> like out of the tube. Mm. So I might line my lips more with something. But for right now, I'm gonna go in with Revlon in the shade Siren. It's And I am going to line my lips because this is like really orange. <laughs> I'm gonna go over all of that with my Fenty Balm. So it blends with the brown better. Yeah. So I am going to do the finishing touch, which is a highlight. And I think I'm gonna use Squeeze Me. And then I think we use like every color. I don't think I told you I use creamsicle, um, but I kind of just use it um, in tangent with zested to blend the yellow. Um, so I kind of use both of them. Um, I use sunkissed. Oh, did I? I did not use rise and grind. I should have used that. Let's just put that on my cheeks too. <laughs> Let's put some rise and grind on my cheeks too. Mm -hmm. Boom. And then I use everything. 
Yep, I use this in the center. Oh, I went back and I put a little bit of clementine on my lid just so I can get like the big sparkles, like, cause you can see that it has like very big sparkles. So just a few of the sparkles. So the finishing, the final, final, squeeze me. I'm gonna use this that as a highlight. you glad so this is kind of the oh well let's go finish up finish up and I will be right back and we will get into ending this video okie dokie finishing touches and we are done with this look I literally have to like back up because like my hair is so big like Oh my gosh, <laughs> but so it's me, Orange Blossom. <laughs> this is totally how she should have looked um, when they remade her. Um, I this is this I am the self-proclaimed adult version of her now. Like her hair was amazing, um, and it should have never been changed because she was perfect the way that she was. But basically, message to Hollywood, stop changing the skin colors of freaking characters. Stop changing hair textures of black characters. Um, you don't need straight hair or light skin to be beautiful. Everybody's beautiful in their own way. And yeah, they, they need to stop that. But this is me. I am her, she is me, and this is what we are working with. I am essentially, I guess, like an orange now. The funny thing is that I wanted to go in heavier with like orange accessories, but lo and behold, it's hard to find orange accessories. I'm shocked. I am shocked. I am bamboozled. I, I really, I didn't think it would be that difficult, but it, like, it really was. Like, this is all I found. <laughs> um, yeah, so, mm. but it doesn't matter. It's all good. And I had like this, which, oh, oopsie. I have this, which is actually like a sunflower but they both white, you know, <laughs> orange blossoms, sunflowers, so whatever. But yeah. Sometimes I feel like it's so weird when I don't have like black liner. But I ain't gonna do it. Don't worry, I ain't gonna do nothing else. This was a simple look for my you want to do something a little a little cutesy for halloween uh and um so this is the first of a series um this was one of my planned looks so the theme this year because i'll put my photos from last year Ooh. But basically my theme last year was like duality, which I'm actually really obsessed with. Um, I just feel like everything is balanced, you know, whatever. That's beside the point. We, you wanna have a discussion about that? Hit me up, I'll do a video where I'm discussing all, of, all about that. Anyways, so that was my theme last year. So every single look was like one half was something different from the, the other half, um, which was super fun and I enjoyed it. Um, so for this year, my theme is sweet. So this is the first of many. Um, she's sweet. Oranges are sweet. And so that is, that's my theme this year. So feel free to guess in the comments, uh, what my other looks are, but. <laughs> oh, and, uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Um, this was a really cute palette to use. I really enjoyed using this. Every single one of my looks um, also has a corresponding palette. So if you 
know of palettes that are sweet palettes, um, then I'm probably going to be using them in this series in these upcoming weeks. But yeah, I love it. It's so cute. I love it. I really, I know that people are giving them a lot of crap for having like these like one tone palettes, but I just find them so adorable. Like I have the pink one somewhere, whatever. And ugh, so cute. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed using those. Mm -hmm. Um. So yeah, that is all I had to say. If you enjoyed me, Orange Blossom, which by the way, I live in Florida and I still couldn't find orange stuff. Like we like orange state of the country. Mm hmm. Anyways, <laughs> if you enjoyed, be sure to like this video. It is very helpful. And don't forget to subscribe to your girl. There's more content coming your way. And don't forget to ring that bell so that you are notified when I upload. Thank you for watching this video and for clicking on my face. Thank you for returning if you're someone you're a returning viewer, <laughs> subscriber. Um, and I will see you all in the next video. Deuces. <laughs>